Very ominous. Uh, Fox says, that's really weird. Games can sometimes barely keep my attention, but then an MMO tells me to grind for three weeks for a fancy sword, and I'm like, hell yes, let's do it. What's wrong with me? It, there's, I mean, obviously people have studied it, but the, psych the psychology of gaming is fascinating. It's fascinating. You know, and I can't, I can't figure these things out either because there are there are there are times where I will tell folks like oh I didn't really get into such and such, such a game because of this 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 and then another game that I absolutely love I'll start thinking about I'm like well that has this this and this and I still like it <laughs> I don't yeah it doesn't always make sense <laughs> all right save select which one which should be our save slot this is like the most important choice ever in a game by the way, this is Boomerang X. It's pub uh, It's developed by a game company called Dang. And um, published by Devolver Digital. And thanks to Devolver for sending me a copy. Yeah. Bottom? <laughs> Which one? The bottom one. Oh. Two? Four is right out. <laughs> Four. Um, two. Two. Pick two, my lord. All right, two. Here we go. Chapter select new. Uh, let's look at the options. Let's look at the options. I haven't had a chance to check this out. Mesh detail normal. Field of view. Usually we go with like 90. Screen shake. Probably don't want screen shake. V-Sync's fine. Permanent portals. I have no idea. UI safe area. HUD scale. All right. That looks good. Audio. 75 is across the board. All right. We'll try it. Controls. I wonder if I should use keyboard or mouse for this. I'll try I'll try keyboard or mouse first, but we'll see. Um Is there a crouch? Okay, move left, right, forward and back, throw boomerang left click, slingshot left click, recall boomerang right click. Use flux. Left shift. Activate power up E, swap power up Q. All right, I'm sure they're going to teach us all this. Activate comet mode. Okay, that's a mouse button. Uh, okay, jump, air brake, also space bar. Use flux. Maybe me maybe using flux will be on my mouse too. We'll see. I don't know what that is yet, but sounds important. Gameplay. Difficulty balanced for mouse. We provided this option to tune the game experience to what feels most comfortable with your setup. If you're playing a gameplay, we recommend using balance for controller. This is also a good setting to change if you'd like to tweak the general challenge of the game. Controller, okay. Speed run. Oh, they have speed running stuff like baked in. Interesting. Is that pronounced in the 90s style? Dang. Um, yes. And accessibility. Okay, okay, okay. Sweet. All right. Lots of good options. New game. Let's do it. Blind speed run. Let's go. Hey, Hobble Bottom. What's up? Those my hands? I'm a mummy? Not that. Yeah, I know. Am I a mummy? <laughs> Only a little dry skin. The end of ca can coast. All right, Reginity, you got the job. Yes! Fantastic! I'm so happy for you. Yeah, we were talking about the glaive earlier, Nolan, from uh, Crawl. Because I, because Devolver is actually selling. Oh my God, you can jump far. Whoa. Okay. Devolver is selling uh, um, an actual boomerang. 
with the copy of this game if you go to their merch store. And it looks like the glaive. Okay. Where's the loot? I need loot. I need a way to defend my shelf. You're so happy. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. I like when otters have good news. Where are the whips? I know. I know. There's no whips yet. And there's a whip. Yeah, it's pretty cool so far. Uh, you know, if we get into this game at all, then we're going to spend uh, some time with some games that offer weapons you don't normally see. Like whips and boomerangs. Ooh. There it is. Throw. Hey, I got an achievement already. I'm so good at this game. Hiya! Oh, this is fun already. I'm not even doing anything. All right, back to the village. <laughs> oh, you can avoid it, and then it keeps flying. Hey, that's pretty cool. Hey, Thomas. All right, let's go. Speaking of, I finished Castlevania Season 3 last night. Amazing, isn't it? We're on, like, Episode 2 of Season 4. So good. All right, let's go. Let's go play crawl. <gasps> All right, what does this say? Charge. Oh. Nice. Like a bridge of a troubled water. Hey, cheese whiz, what's up? This game looks pretty sweet. We just started. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So the strategy is to throw it and jump circles around your enemy. Yes, I like that. You finished season three last night too? That is weird, Phantom Lord. I want that, whatever that is. I broke it. Oh. These bees? They didn't say there'd be bee killing in this. Oh, that was a... Whoa! Triple kill! Kill them! Kill them all! Give me back my weapon! Oh, I can recall it! Oh, okay. Right click is recall, remember? Oh, that's much better. Much better than waiting. <laughs> yes! Alright, do I need only need to kill the yellow guys? Yeah, that's true. Okay. That's really cool so far. Alright. Alright. So cool. Cool, cool, cool. Well, I'm trying hard mode with the waiting. Yeah, waiting was kind of sucky. I'm like, I want to be able to shoot again, but I can't. Okay. Recall boomerang. Oh, they just taught me that. How's it feel so far early on? So far, so good. So far, the controls seem really tight. What do I have to do? Get all three of them really quick? There we go. I had to not miss one of them. What's this? Drink it. Okay, that's a life. A shield. Oh, okay. Uh, what are they teaching me here? The fact that I can throw it all over the place and kill things? Okay. 
<laughs> I think I already knew that. The Composer's Garden. All right, here we go. Waves. Okay, now I need two to go to next level. All right. Now I need four. Okay, I gotcha. One. Oh, there's one up there. Hey! Now I need five. Beautiful Amish. Ah, I got hurt! They hit my shield. Now I need six. Oh, there's a double. Okay. Six to six. Can I get my life back? Wait, what is this? Bonus? Why are there more? Composer's Garden achievement unlocked. Where's my health back? This game would be impossible with the controller. Mm, if they have an aim assist, it could be okay. But I, I am not regretting my choice of using the mouse. Yeah. You actually have to open the door. Silly. Okay. We're not in Kansas anymore. Uh... What? Hey, did you guys see that? There was a path over there. <laughs> I know there was a path over there. I saw it. <laughs> Bring it back. Oh, crap. Okay. So I'm gonna cut this one. <laughs> okay. I'll bite. I'll bite. I'm making music with my boomerang. Kinda. Slingshot unlocked. Where's the slingshot? Slingshot to boomerang. Left, left? Oh my goodness. That's gonna change everything. Did you take fall damage? Oh, this is gonna be wild. The skill ceiling just got really high on this, meaning I weep for my future. Okay. So where do you want me to go this time? Okay. I'm just gonna go down here again. What were in those brownies we had last night? This game's weird. Okay, all right. Wow. Hey, darkness, what's up? Oh my god, this is so trippy. Very weird. All right, stop midair. Hold space bar. <clears throat> oh, there's spikes there. Okay. Got it. Okay. That's pretty cool. Nice. We'll build spikes there. Honestly. I'm 
doing great, Darkness. I feel like today's Friday, but beyond, besides that, I'm doing great. Oh, I waited too long. Climb up there, dude. Ugh. Hey, look, I got my health back. Health platforms. After taking damage, standing on a health platform will regenerate one child. Speed runs in this game are going to be fast. Yeah, no, they're going to go crazy. Thank God you're not the only one thinking this is Friday. I know, I know. I've had like a super, like I've had an enhanced stress week, but it was all good. It was good stress. I was excited about the tournament yesterday. There was a lot that went into getting ready for that. Um, so, like today just feels like Friday. I feel like I did all the work for the week already. <laughs> This is interesting. This reminds me of uh, Ghost Runner a little bit, right? Hey, off on a shelf. What is this over here? This is a dead body. Some sort of thrike, thrikeen, thrikeen, insect mantis man. Oh, that's just me falling down the hole and never coming out. Yeah. For a moment, you thought this was Phantom Abyss with the new, new weird whip? I can see that. There we go. All right, what's up here? All right, seven waves. I guess that's how the combat works. It's waves. I don't know what I'm fighting this time. Oh, spiders. Get off me, dude. They're up there. Okay, next wave. I got that one without even knowing. Didn't get him. There we go. All right, here comes the music. Oh, that was like a jellyfish looking thing. Wave seven to seven. I was trying to go up there. I don't know why it's harder to go up there than I think it is. Oh, I died? I died. Oh, we got to start that all over. I was on wave seven too. All right, let's not die. No more dying. Okay. You guys can't get me up here. Double kill. Oh, come on. Music reminds you of Kung Fu Hustle. Is that what is that? What is Kung Fu Hustle? Oh, I didn't mean that. I meant to recall. I recall Central Park in fall. I gotta see what that achievement is. Breakfast.
All right, that was one of those octopus things. That comes in wave five. There's two on top. I'm gonna need. There we go. Last wave. Don't mess it up. This requires situational awareness, precision, throwing, and well-timed dodging. I'm gonna stink at this. There you go. What achievements did I get? Kenok the Exile Tyrant. I cleared Kenok. Oh, okay. And clear the Grunge Pit. Alright, let's see what this does. Oh, I got my... I got my, uh... Shield back. Kung Fu Hustle is basically a live-action martial arts movie in the style of Looney Tunes. Sounds amazing. Let's see where we can go now. Is that Turk? Oh, it's not Turkey. I, <laughs> I was like, Turkeys? Mmm. I think they're helmets. Bring out the helmets and bring out the best. Do we get a second life? Yes, okay. Two shields now. Thorn Tamer's like, well then stink on. I'm gonna stink on. The tuning cord. Are we gonna unlock a new ability? Flux, okay, that's the, the other button on my mouse. We'll see what this does. Flux, hold L shift while charging to slow time. Okay, why do I want to slow time though? <laughs> Oh, I see. Oh, this is gonna bake my noodle. It's so funny, like there's like 50 times there that I thought I was dead, but you're, you can actually survive for a while there. All right. Just got here, what are you watching? Boomerang X, out today. Hashtag game if you're interested in taking a look. Oh boy. The Grudge Pit. Oh, hell yeah. I'm ready. Oh, now I'm just spazzing around. All right, hold on. No spazzing. Okay, wave two of eight. Whoa! <laughs> okay. I like having my back to a wall. Whoa! That guy came in. Hot jump a lot. Oh, these guys like. Those guys really track on you. Oh, there's something up here. There's some mega guy up there. I don't know how to kill him. Oh, he's got a... Does he have a red dot on his back? Oh, 
Yes. Okay. Oh, there's more. I thought I was done. I thought I was done! I'm sorry. <laughs> Why am I apologizing? I should have known as soon as there were speedrunning strats. That it'd be something like this. <laughs> speedrunning settings in the menu. Wave six to eight. Holy crap. This is hard. This is my new strategy. Slow time in between in every throw. I lost my uh, second loif. Oh, I missed. I'm gonna have to change. I think I have to change my controls. Because using my mouse, I have to use this stop time thing constantly, and being on a mouse button is cramping my hand already. more whoa We one shot the grudge pit. Woo! Oh, I have a heal in the middle of the arena. Oh, you're right. I did. Is that active during the fight? Was it? Oh, interesting. That's crazy. All right, that was intense. I um, I actually like the control I have, but I, I it's hurting my hand already, and we just started, so that's not good. Um, flux. Use flux. It's L shift. I don't know if that's good. Um, F to talk. Why don't we put talk on C? I don't know if we have to actually have to use that or not. But uh, let me try flux F. And then I can stop cramping my hand, maybe. Alright, I think I can try that. I like there's no fall damage at least. Alright, let's see what we, else we can get into. More turkeys. Mmm, turkey. 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 I like these environments. Like, look at this. Like, what? This is cool. The Shrine of Caspide. What? Friend or foe? See, talk. Okay, that's how I talk to things. Wow, look at this. Centipede, millipede with actual items? Ah, what are you? You aren't one of the your advantage. Well, have you dropped it from? I'm so sorry. I've been alone on this island ever since the things wiped out the Yoran. My name is Tepper. I am terrible at singing, better at cooking. Ha ha. Is that one of the mantid weapons? Are you using it to fight those monsters? Oh, of all the terrible, terrible ideas I've heard of and had myself, I can definitely say that is a bad idea. Look, if you intend on fighting, I've got to warn you, there's something down there. It reminds me of the river leviathans that terrorized my village back home. I only caught little glimpses, but I think all these dark beasts come from it. If you can get through, I'll try and meet you somewhere ahead. I'm good at scurrying between crevices and avoiding these ghouls. Okay, fantastic then. Hmm, 
Oh, this shrine is one of the last quiet spots on the island. It also has the best tasting slime. Try some. It's over there by those bamboo shoots. The urine told me that the big mantid with the antlers over there is Caspide, someone who is so good at playing music it made magic happen or something like that. Imagine that! I make pretty good scatter moss roast, but it won't make you levitate. Legend goes Caspide submerged themselves in water, played a perfectly tuned set of strings, and then ascended? Can't believe myself. I'm the last bastion of knowledge of your end culture, and I can barely remember the legends. But I do remember all those recipes they taught me. Figures. <laughs> he just waved with all of his left legs. Tepin is slurping slime. Okay. I like that he waved with all his left legs. Kneel before Zod. Let me slurp. Oh, another one. Hey, Fam Slayer, what's up? trying to go up here, but I don't think that's the way. It's not the way. Sing. Sing a song. Scatter shot. Okay. Scattershot. E. After killing two enemies on one throw. Single throw times two. All right, hold on. Okay, scattershot. So you get like a shotgun? Oh, that's interesting. What's the range on that? Decent enough. All right, what if happens if I kill like... That's still three. Uh... I don't know how to line up. This should be three right here, right? There we go, that's three. Is that any different? Okay, so it's it's medium range, I would say. Oh, 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 they want me to actually use it on the door. Interesting. Okay. There you go. Okay. Got it. Hey, Demon King. Boomerang! We've gone from whips to boomerangs. Hey, wake up. Stay on target, Bog. Okay. I like how each room is so different. Bam Slayer, you love the sound it makes when you kill these enemies? I'll have to pay attention to it. The Valley of the First Nymphs. All right, let's go. How many waves? Seven waves. First one requires a ton. Whoa. Wow. Why was that tire guy? Oh, they have multiple heal spots. Nice. All 
All right. See, now I'm able to stop time a little bit. I'm not as good at stopping time, I should say, because I rebound it. I'm trying to think, like, how could I do it? That would be a good keybind. A foot pedal would be good. <laughs> I gotta kill these summoners first. These guys just keep making new peoples. Nice. Here comes the tire. Woo! Alright, I need healing. Oh, wow. Whoa, holy moly! Those guys come flying in like a wrecking ball. Oh, I can't, I can't get that guy. There we go. They're constantly rotating away from you, which makes sense. Woo! A shotgun blast came in handy. Wow. Damn! I think I healed and immediately lost it again. I think what I'm doing is I am teleporting too much. Like that. What I should be just recalling. kill this guy, but... Or this guy, but they keep... Oh, no, this guy I have to kill. They keep spawning people, so... They're like enemy number one. Oh, okay. Wow, that's hard. Was that achievement? Clear the just to clear it. Okay. All right. Um, those wave battles are <laughs> like there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of time where I just have to be like laser focused. Haru uh, Haru says I keep discovering cool indie niche games on your stream. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, I like playing games like this. Just like, just something different, something that's new, something that no one's seen before. Try to bring attention to these type of games. Because there's so many good games that are just, you know, and you would look at this and go, this is not like the type of thing Bog typically plays, but you know what? It's fun. It's challenging. Reminds me of Ghost Runner a little bit. Oh, this is beautiful. Urine wood. <laughs> yeah, we're going to call it Uran wood. <laughs> Urine wood doesn't make it sound appealing. Uh... <laughs> Iris says, I spent way too many hours in Phantom Abyss because of you. I'll take that as a good thing. <laughs> I'm glad you're enjoying it. Uh, this one just came out today. Um, type hashtag game if you want to find out more about it. All right, here we go. Looks like a... Can I go... Oh, I can go... Oh, sure. I can go all the way down here. Should you? I don't know. Wave... This is a huge arena, though. 
All right, what are we fighting? Fighting you. Okay. here. Hello. So what I'm basically doing now is just always holding down the button that makes the time stop or go slow so that every time I teleport, it, it like immediately slows down time. Like you can keep it held down and it works. And I'm just planning each aim once the time is slowed down. Okay. Uh, I like how they highlight through walls the people you need to kill. Though I just lost that one. Somehow. Stay on target. Oh, it's over here. There we go. Whoa, that's a big guy. Is that a big guy? That's a big guy. Oh. Oh! Oh, wow, that's very... Oh, you can't go that high. That's to stop my whole strategy, isn't it? Very Horizon Zero Dawn shape. to get him in the head, too. Okay. That thing's dead, right? Who else? Oh, way up there. Okay. Last round. Nice miss. Thank you. Last round. I got another one of these guys. These guys are tough. Because they make it so I can't go all the way up. This game is really dizzying, Merm. Yes. Probably not for uh, folks who get motion sick. I will tell you though, uh, it's fun. It, the movement is very, very fun. Like I'm kind of flying all over the place here. Oh, I went through the ceiling again. How did that not? Ooh. I gotta heal. I keep forgetting that I can stop midair. There we go. Bing.
Okay. And there we go. Wow. Tough. All right. We beat urine wood. <laughs> we did it. So where do I go? This is like the Ewok village. There we go. We go this way. Crypt of the Cursed Blood. Like, are we gonna find out what happened to all these like mantis warriors? Not in the urine wood anymore. Anymore. <laughs> oh, hello. You made it. What a relief! I really thought you'd be mashed up or turned into slop or run through some nightmare creature. There are a truly fascinating number of ways you could possibly have gone wrong. But we're here now. I scrounged up some cave mold on my way down if you want something to eat. Yes, please. Don't eat the plants that grow out of the heads, though. Unethical. But they also taste bad. I don't know why they put the plants in their dead. These are, hmm, special, <laughs> special urine. I uh, saw one had two extra arms who played on a harp. The other urine called them Caspides children or something like that. I thought every mantid was Capiti's descendant. I guess the translation song isn't perfect. A really glooming spot, isn't it? Lots of damp caves in my travels. Hey, this is going to sound really strange, but just bear with a many-legged fool for a moment. I came to this world through a doorway. I think you understand. I saw you pass through something that looks similar back there in the shrine. Doorways between worlds? When I was a wee peed, only a dozen or so legs, I remember falling through one. A wee peed. Don't remember how it happened exactly, but I was suddenly tumbling through the bows of the branches, the boughs of the branches of these huge trees connecting everything together. Planets and stars and places and people all connected. Anyway, that's how I came here. Tumbled right into a group of urine. <laughs> Way down below us. Very hospitable, despite my sudden interest. They seem to think I'd be sent to them by, well, it doesn't matter. I only bring this up because the doorway might still be open. And if these creatures get through it... Teppan is clicking their legs together. Okay. Can you kill Teppan? No. Good. Because that would have been awful. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay. So, is this a lab? This looks like a lab or torture something or other give me even more life because that means they're gonna make the game that much harder 